new modification. Hello. Peter. system it's that's just lit up now and just slide it underneath okay so that's burning quite well took a little bit to get started but she's definitely going and here, see there's a flame flicking into the rocket tube. It's not massive, but it's steady enough. All right, we're about 20 minutes in. You see now how the whole pellet uh, basket is actually all lit up. It's definitely a good flame going on in there. And you can see how it's going here. The top of the is 100 plus and there we go look at that it's a much better flame in there it's pretty good close the lever down create a little bit of back pressure and it will heat up the stove a bit better we'll get more temperature trapping in the top that temperature will go up and we also see that it's burning quite clean just a little wispiness there but that's pretty clean now I've got the door open a crack actually close that down so I'm going to just close that and see what happens here it'll create less a slower draft across the flame face it's still getting air from the heat rises and the air it's going to get will be hotter it'll be preheated so it'll take a little while for the whole system to adjust to that I'll give it five minutes to settle in and then we have another look at how it's burning. One of the things we're looking for is for the uh, pellets to self-feed. So as the pellets at the bottom burn out and turn to ash, they should crumble down like it just did then, bringing new pellets down into the burn zone. And it's a delicate balance of getting the bars just right, the gaps and the thickness of the bars, and it looks like it might be okay. Also the gap underneath the bars, so there's a little bit of flaming backwards just now, but you can see from the top of the new pellets, that's because I've got this door closed, so the draft is maybe a little bit less than it was before. In terms of a steady, stable burn, it's running super clean now. This is the Eco 2. We're using, um, I haven't weighed that, but it's probably about a kilo of pellets over um, half an hour, or less than a kilo over half an hour. It's definitely a very stable burn. We've got a steady uh, close to 300 at the top point here not as hot as it can be with wood but probably hot enough so we're coming up to the end of the burn with the door closed there's no smoke coming out of the top here at all it keeps drawing through there so that's nice we've been stable on around 300 at the top which is not fabulously hot but it's a pretty consistent the rocket's just starting to finish because the fuel's finished. But it's definitely uh, hit a stable, self-feeding process, which is what we like. It's been burning clean. It's definitely outputting heat, although not as much as if the fuel box is full of fuel, but that would be because the burn size is a fraction of what it would normally be with wood. So 
It's good for a nice, steady, slow burn, but not for a fast, hot burn.